It is done. We are inexorably bound to the power of this hive artifact, and to one another. The Crown of Sorrow was once forged by Savathun's hand, designed as a psychic prison, binding the mind of its bearer to her will. Now it serves a new witch. You have become a Reaper of Darkness, dooming slain nightmares to imprisonment within the Crown. Callus has begun to forge a bond between the Leviathan and the dormant pyramid buried on the moon. I do not yet know why or how, but with enough imprisoned nightmares, I can use their essence to invoke a ritual to sever those connections Callus is forging. For now, return to the Leviathan and seek out concentrations of these new nightmares. Destroy them and bind them to the crown. As I warned Zavala, nightmares wear familiar faces and speak with familiar voices. They manifest our darkest fears. You will assist Crow when it comes time to perform the first severance ritual. We both know what form his nightmare will take. It will do everything in its power to stop you. Be wary. Failsafe, you feeling any better? Yes, thank you. As well as a ship AI can when her crew has died. We'll always be here for you. And who's better than us? We're awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. the essences of these nightmares. I wonder how Mara is feeling right now, with her baby brother alive and refusing to acknowledge her. What a cruel knife to wield. 
She's not my sister. I'm not doing this to spite her. So you admit you're ignoring her on purpose? Is it because you're scared of her? Or because you're scared of who you are when you're around her? No. Oh. Or maybe you're just afraid you like it. Shut up. Shut up! Welcome to the Underbelly, Guardians. Your mission is simple, but nonetheless treacherous. Deal our first cut in severing Callus's connection to the Pyramid. You both have a route to the Severance Site, and ritual amplifiers to place. Crow, as above on the Leviathan, so too nightmares will manifest below. Yours takes the shape of Aldrin Sov. Endure him. Each amplifier grounds our severance in the Leviathan's connection to the darkness. Loyalist welcoming party ahead. Maybe I can find a way around. This is what the Traveler made you for. We're killers. Don't shy away from it. I don't kill unless I have to. Right. You only murder the deserving. Like Keitel Scion. That was a mistake. It was a mistake. Lucky Saladin owned it for us, just like Mara always used to. Barrier ahead. This pod's forge will grant you passage.
Sounds like we both hit resistance, Guardian. I doubt they had as much trouble as you. I've seen them work. At least I'm not one and done. You take resurrection for granted. Remember how we begged Mara to save us? To make us awoken as we slipped away from existence? Do you ever stop talking? <laughs> Guardian, that's your second amplifier? Good. Crow mimics a stoic affectation well enough, but I can tell his nightmare is wearing away at him.
Guardian, the crow wants to be me, or he's afraid he already is. Is there a third option? Mm, languish in your miserable limbo of a life? The scorn will drag you into mine eventually. Those Elixni deserve to rest in peace. What you did to them, I would never. We raised them. Gave them a second chance. I thought you were all about second chances. the lockdown, Guardian. Arc energy is being diverted through a nearby conduit. Finish this. <clears throat> Is this why you push so hard to remember me, little girl? So you could burn Aldrin at the stake and prove your independence. It's the right thing to do. I have to. How many failed attempts to do the right thing before you realize our fervor always backfires? Mara had you wrapped around her finger. Everything I do is because I want to. Sure. Outcome's the same, isn't it? You cut out pieces of yourself until there was nothing left of your humanity. You enjoyed it. That's the difference. Please. You'd swallow all those whiny little morals given the right push. You've come so close already. That's why you run. I'm not running. Hmm. We'll see. Our legacy is calling. Father.
was alone. Hated it just like you were. You can help him, but you just don't. Because it's one more step towards me. It's why you won't help our sister either. After everything Mara's done for us. I don't want her help! This isn't a knife fight, Crow. Accept his words. Move through them. No! No. I'm going to enjoy ripping him out of me. Try. I'll just burrow back in, over and over, until I'm all you have. I... Ares, what do I do? Retreat is not weakness. Breathe. We can try again, in time. Sorry I let you down. Come to tell me it's not my fault? Hey, Guardian. I know this is on me. You don't have to feed me any comforting platitudes. I've been running from the truth for long enough. You know... When I first came to the city... I told these little lies... about who I was, or where I came from. Nothing hurtful, just a few stories to keep a comfortable distance from the truth. To fill in the blanks when I got my memories back. I remembered Aldrin did the same thing. He started little rumors, recounted adventures to an audience, planted gossip in Mara's ear just to watch those stories spread. We're exactly the same. Down to the instincts. It's in my blood. <laughs> I thought I could do this. I thought I could prove to Zavala and Keitel and you and everyone else that I was better than him. But lies... They only get us so far. It appears the situation is far more complex than I first believed. The Leviathan has become an extension of the Lunar Pyramid, channeling feelings of shame and regret into reality. The Pyramid did so as a security system, driving away those who would tamper with it. But what is happening on the Leviathan? This is purposeful. Malicious. As the nightmares on the Leviathan spread, it could threaten Earth and beyond. Callus' bond with the Pyramid endangers all of us. Crow was unprepared to face his own demons when we attempted to sever it. And though I may be able to counsel him through the next confrontation, that will take time. You should return to the Leviathan. Continue harvesting the nightmares and disrupting Callus' plans. We will speak again soon. There is a misconception among the Vanguard that nightmares are like spirits.